Hey everyone, hope your Wednesday is going well. Like we said, we're going to go ahead and open up these championship collection boxes, kind of see what's inside of them, maybe go through the, uh, we'll, we'll definitely uh, go through them. Hopefully these will be as good as the last three we got. Got them from the same seller on eBay. Um, I can't remember the the name, but I do appreciate the that person. Don't know man or woman or whoever. Um but I'm glad they had some of these available. There you see some of the packs that you could possibly pull. Nine factory sealed packs, eight assorted of racing cards, and one bonus item. These are cards that you could possibly pull. Not 100% likely, but could. So let's go ahead and look. Our bonus item is another Jimmy Johnson sticker. I believe we've pulled this one before, or window cling, or whatever you want to call it. what we got going on in here we'll got a there's our cards we'll go through those in a minute and then some packs one two three four five six seven eight so we did or nine packs yeah nine packs looks like we did get some more absolute so i'm kind of excited about those two packs of absolute in there We'll go to box number two here and get it ripped open. See what we can find on the inside of it. Uh, don't see anything there in the bottom. No sticker in that one. What's our bonus item going to be? Hmm. Uh, magical, probably this thing. There's the eight cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, bunch of press pass packs in this one. Literally, look at that. All Well, we did get two nice prism packs from 2016, but the rest of it is 2009 press pass. Not going to complain, but this is our bonus. I wouldn't call that much of a bonus, so it's just some little cars that you put together. I'm going to... I'll figure out something to do with this uh probably won't be anything that we will see here on the channel because i i've opened a few of those and they're just little plastic things that you assemble not really anything exciting we'll go ahead and open the third one and see what we come up with and we are going to have looks like a keychain Who's it going to be? Jimmy Johnson. Of course, in the last round, we did pull a Jeff Gordon keychain. Key fob, whatever you want to call it. Then there's our stack of cards. We'll go through those here in just a second. Just want to see what else we ended up with. We've got another pack of Absolute there. That's exciting. Oh, wow. Press Pass Legends. That's nice. Looks like we got some tracks. We had those in the first one. So we got three packs of Absolute in total and a pack of Legends. We got some Eclipse, got some Premium. I'll get all those sorted out here and we'll we'll maybe rip a couple of these packs. Let's see what was in the first jewel case. Never know what you're going to get in these. Start off here with Johnny Sauter. 2011 Press Pass. Carl Edwards. It looks like the rest of them are going to be in this way. Uh, EA Sports winner. Is that Dale Jr.? It is Dale Jr. And we got some of these IndyCar cards. Randy Lewis. Gary Bettenhausen. Mike Groff, driving for A.J. Foyt. Roberto Guerrero, 1984 Co-Rookie of the Year at Indy. And Transporters. Is that the Junior Motorsport? No, it's uh, Mark Martin's hauler, I believe. Yeah, Hendrick Motorsports, Mark Martin. I was thinking it was the Junior Motorsports hauler, but it's not. Then it looks like some of these retail exclusives. Uh, Harvick Stewart. Yeah, there you see TSA, KHA. So those are me, Walmart, or Target, or Kmart, or whoever. Exclusives, not too bad there. This is a Dale Jr. set here, shifting gears. So 
it's going to have all sorts of different pictures chronicling chronicling Dale Jr.'s life, and that's essentially what this one is. Just all the rest of them are Dale Jr. cards. Then our final one, there you see Ryan Newman on one side and Mark Martin on the other. Hopefully something decent in these ones, as those first two have kind of been a little flat. Doesn't look like we're going to get any better here. Mark Martin Acceleration. Then we got a four-time Indy 500 winner, Al Unser, with these, uh, is that All World Racing? I can't remember. Yeah, uh, AW Sports, so it's probably All World Tony Bettenhausen, his brother Gary Bettenhausen. Then we have some, there's one more stuck to it there. Scott Brayton, who passed away at Indy in 1996 in a practice crash. David Reagan. I don't think I've ever seen these ones before. Press, pass, starting grid. So there's some kind of insert there. Casey Kane. Brian Vickers. And Ryan Newman. So... Some cards that I don't have, which I'm happy about. Some interesting cards. A couple of nice inserts here or retail exclusives. Then a few of the IndyCar cards, which a couple of these I can still get signed. Both Bettenhausen's have passed away. So Roberto Guerrero, Mike Groff, and Al Sr. seem to be the most likely that I could get signed. Let's kind of go through these packs real quick and see what we ended up with. We've got a 08 Press Pass Premium, 09 Premium. There's one of our packs, Absolute, so it's got something something sticking out there. More premiums, we got some more tracks here. So I'm kind of just separating these by, you know, uh, potential. So we know the press pass, we'll put it here. Put the prism in this stack. I think we had one Absolute in this one, which we'll put in our stack of our higher end stuff. Looks like we got more premiums, more tracks, Legend. And put Eclipse there, Premium there, and Tracks over here. We're not going to... We'll just open a couple of the tracks today as the Martin Tricks Junior car takes a tumble off the back of the table. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll open up a couple of these tracks today. Maybe we'll get something good in it. Retail, four cards. Don't know that we're going to really have good odds to pull much of anything. You do have opportunity for autographs. One in 240 packs. So maybe this is pack number 241 or something like that where we'll we'll, we'll get where uh, uh, come on. May have to get scissors out for this one because this is just not cooperating with us at all. So there we go. Rip the end of it off. And see what we come up with. Start off with Carl Edwards. Legend, Tiny Lund, passed away at Talladega in 1975. Jeff Burton, and our sticker is Dale Jarrett. That famous UPS, brown and... Uh, the, the numbers are orange, but the paint jobs are usually brown and white. And we're going to have to do the same thing with this one. Get this one started. We've got four packs to, or four cards here. Start off with Jeff Gordon. Guess if you're going to have a nice card, that's going to be one that you want to get. David Green, 1994 Bush Series champion. Dale Earnhardt Jr., multiple time most popular driver. And Ken Schrader. Of course, he drove for the Wood Brothers there in the mid-2000s. I can't remember the years right offhand. Somewhere about 2007, 8, 9 or thereabouts. He kind of had a rough time with that team. I thought that was going to be a pairing that was just going to take off and have a lot of success. Unfortunately for them, they did not. And they just uh, they, they had a rough way to go. So, uh, wish wish things could have went better for that team. Uh, just, for some reason, things don't always work uh, the way you think they should. I kind of felt the same way with Ricky Rudd driving for the Wood Brothers. It just didn't, it didn't work. I don't know if it was, uh, you know, communication or just the cars. It's any number of things with uh, teams that you think that should be successful and aren't. And sometimes... 
things happen and and then sometimes there's drivers that are incredibly successful in a situation that you didn't think they would be so anyway hope you guys enjoyed today's video enjoy the rest of your wednesday we'll probably open a few more of these packs tomorrow and, and get a little bit deeper into that kind of enjoyed seeing what we got uh kind of bummed that our bonus item in one of them was just one of those generic things but hey that happens and then the cards that we got, you've seen the, the ones that we opened. Not really anything spectacular, but you can't win them all. But I'm just happy that we get to open some cards. So thanks again for watching. Enjoy the rest of your Wednesday, and we will see you tomorrow.